Hello, and thank you so much for stopping by Resource Rundown. So we are taking old things and making them new again, I tell you. So what you see here is a blog that is devoted to mothers, uh, whether they're single, whether they're married, whether they're low income, whether they are um, just middle income or rich, what have you. Mothers have pretty much the same types of challenges all across the board you have little ones or you have teens or you have adult sons and daughters and there's the frustration and the stress and everything else that comes with motherhood so what i wanted to do was create a, a presentation related to some of the issues that mothers uh, deal with but then i decided for purposes of this video we're just going to go ahead and we're going to show you presentations in action using just a simple business uh plan okay so this is our um our example is going to be a busy mom who's just starting out with an art business and she's going to need to present um before a, a small audience who might be interested in purchasing some items or taking her business to the next level we're also going to be using a tool called task aid and this particular tool, as you can see here, there's limits when you're using the freebies, but this particular tool, Task Aid, is going to help us with creating uh, her task list of activities that she does personally so that she can be able to focus more on her business, okay? because people have real issues when it comes to starting their business uh, or working elsewhere and they need to be able to balance both the personal as well as the professional so two things are going to happen here and i am using once again um, my muse if you will um, a blog that is for uh, those moms who are divorced single married and even depressed so here we go so she wishes to start her business and we're going to call her business um we're just going to say nancy's art shop made up name not a real client but if you do need my services to help you out with future presentations and things of that sort by all means reach out okay and then she's going to be offering uh, some uh, acrylic paintings. That is something that I do as a hobby. <laughs> so she's offering, she, that she, this business of hers um, offers uh, uh, acrylic paintings, okay? And so we're going to create this business plan for her, okay? And the products, uh, the product name is going to be uh, acrylic paintings. Her sub industry is she's a she's an artist. She's an acrylic an acrylic artist. okay this is a startup she wants to achieve profitability she's given herself a year and her name is nancy no nonsense <laughs> all right so here we go now she's got some customer uh, company customer name I don't know we're just going to go ahead and make up some names All right, and we're just going to go ahead. <laughs> the competitor's name is Amazon. Woo, she has her work cut out for her. 
So while that's working, we're going to go ahead and we're going to go to Busy Mom's task list here. Now, what I did was I went on and I used task aid. Now, what task aid is, is it's basically a productivity application where you can collaborate with others. You can um, just uh, create your task list in mind. You can have mind maps. It's just an overall really good uh, productivity app. And so what I did was in my mind, I thought about the typical things that busy moms do, and I asked Task AI to create a task list for this. And as you can see here to the uh, right of your screen, you can see that uh, that has been created. Okay. Uh, so it went on, it did that, and then it asked me to add to project, which I did and now it shows up here now you can present this in a variety of different ways maybe you're the busy executive or the owner or you're the nonprofit or the manager or what have you and you want your task list to be created so that you can present it before others right um, it could be anything that is routine, or it could be something that you're thinking about doing in the future, but you got to present it uh, so that it is professional. So let's say Busy Mom's task list, she doesn't want it presented this way, but she prefers it on a board. So we can be able to do that. We could be able to add her tasks and put them on the different boards, okay? Or we can just simply ask AI to add the project on a board for us, okay? And then we can tweak accordingly. We can have AI set up a calendar for her, and then all of her tasks appear on a calendar. Or we can just simply type in what we want AI to do on each day or week, okay? Um, so this is something that is, uh, you know, we would copy paste each task. Um, so we can be able to do that. So we type in the information and then it goes from there. We can have AI create an action task list, right? With these cool little boxes here um, in a spreadsheet uh, form or we can create a mind map with all of her tasks okay or if it was uh executives right with all of their titles we could make a organizational um an organizational um chart for uh, for the business owner okay so this is just one of those uh, types of applications that, once again, it helps with organizing thoughts, ideas, all of that good stuff. All right, now let's go back over to Nancy's Art Shop, and we see that it is reviewing uh, some information there. It's generating the deck. Uh, it should take about 31 seconds for this, right? So we're going to click on... Uh, any key to see what it came up with and voila here we have it Nancy's art shop business plan this is a comprehensive roadmap to achieve profit profitability in the acrylic artist market okay and so now we have this presentation we're ready to rock and roll here and Nancy <laughs> she's going to um, be able to present this uh, to whoever she needs to present it to and so that she can be able to add information in here everything from her business plan so for someone who already has a business plan together and you want to put this in a slideshow presentation and you're trying to get people to invest in your business you you know you could be able to do this okay all of the headers are already here now 
someone goes, well, how am I going to be able to fill in all this detailed information? That's where your bard comes in. That's where your Bing chat comes in to play. And how I would do this is I would just simply pull up my favorite chat, which we're going to do that right now. We're going to pull up a chat like a uh, like the Bing chat. We'll pull that back out again. Matter of fact, oh, there we go. It's right there. Nice and easy. And we're going to ask Bing chat to create a, well, first of all, we don't want to be that broad because we want to take every piece of this business plan um, from start to finish. So we want to research everything. We don't want it broad. So we're going to act. Um, we're going to act as a, a business planner. Act as a business advisor or planner. Doesn't matter. And provide us with a executive summary. Executive summary for an acrylic art shop and of course we can be able to change tweak it in whatever way we need to tweak it okay and so here we have being chat giving us an executive summary okay it's given us product services it's given us a target market it's given us more than what we asked for which is awesome okay so what we would do is we would just simply copy and paste and then tweak it based on our uh, business needs. So we would take the, for instance, uh, we go back up here and we have the overview. So Bing Chat already knew what we were after. It knew that we were after a business plan. So we're going to go ahead and we're going to put the company overview right here. right and then we just copy oops, we're just going to highlight and we're just going to paste that baby right in there and we're going to move some stuff up here so that it can be seen and then voila we've got it we've got it you see how fast this is the industry landscape of course we could do we want to make sure that we're doing some research um, on that sort of thing, right? Products and services. She's going to put all of her details in there. And so we're going to highlight once again. We're going to paste that. And then uh, there are those where you might want to rephrase this, right? So there is uh, what I've mentioned in other uh, audio quill bot, and you can be able to use that to rephrase. But you see how simple it is to create a business plan now? <laughs> oh no, somebody's like, wow, this is huge. Exactly. And this is why people are churning out these businesses so quickly. This is why they're able to produce um, as fast as they are when it comes to their task list, staying organized. They've got all these cool bells and whistles and, you know, a little bit of everything to keep them on point, you see. And then, of course, you've got Siri and Alexa and all of those good, um, uh, those, um, those uh, good uh, uh, devices to remind you of what you're supposed to do on top of it. So no excuses busy mom she is organized in her personal life and now she's starting her business and she's organized there too <laughs> so thank you so much for taking the time out to uh, watch and uh, hopefully this will inspire someone to get organized to get that business going okay uh, do check out my uh, blog, years of uh, stories, and I mean, anyone who can relate to being a mom. I am a mom of four sons. They are growing rapidly. We are now 
in the teens and the young adult stages with all four of them. So huge, huge, huge. Thank you once again for stopping by Resource Rundown. Feel free to like, subscribe, comment, share. Check the description box. And if you need my assistance,